Beneath the vibrant city-state of Singapore lies a story of human endeavor, resilience, and groundbreaking engineering. The Deep Tunnel Sewerage System, or DTSS, a massive undertaking that brought people from like-minded, diverse backgrounds together, venturing deep underground to revolutionize the way our city manages its used water and creating a sustainable future for generations to come. This is their story. The Deep Tunnel Sewerage System, or DTSS for short, was conceptualized nearly three decades ago as a sustainable, cost-effective solution. As an ambitious plan to meet Singapore's long-term needs for used water collection, treatment, reclamation and disposal. An underground superhighway, the DTSS uses deep tunnels to convey used water entirely by gravity to centralised water reclamation plants located at the coastal areas. The DTSS requires significant investment and leverage on latest technology. Phase 1 was completed in 2008 and for Phase 2, it all began in 2018 with the Tunnel Boring Machines, or TBMs, the heart of the DTSS project. Here, in the TBM factory, 19 of these massive machines were rigorously tested before being shipped to Singapore. Upon arrival, the TBMs were delivered to various locations across Singapore where the assembly process began. Assembling these colossal machines was a complex and challenging task, requiring a diverse team of experts and workers working tirelessly together to complete this mammoth task and getting the machines ready to embark on its journey underground. In 2019, TBM Baha was the first to embark on the journey. With the TBMs in place, the tunneling started as the primary segmental lining works commenced concurrently. This primary segment provides structural support as the tunnels are excavated. As the TBMs carve their way through the earth, they undergo cutter-head intervention before carrying on their journey. Cutter-head interventions are entry into the TBM front area to change the cutters or repair crushers and the clear chokages. So these are part and parcel of uh, maintenance of the tunnel boring machine. The working space is very tight, very limited, and the workers have to work in a highly compressed air. It's like diving 20 meters underwater, and yet carry out highly specialized work, and at the same time be very vigilant about the ground condition. A total of 2.1 million cubic meters of materials were excavated during tunneling works. To ensure the safety of the tunneling works, a wide myriad of instruments were installed along the tunnel alignments to closely monitor the ground condition. The data gathered are assessed through the monitoring systems to get first-hand insight of any ground movements. Tunneling works were in full swing when COVID-19 struck. The global pandemic brought unforeseen challenges, but the DTSS team adapted and persevered. They implemented safety measures and built dormitories to house workers on site, ensuring the project continued to move forward. We faced many challenges, especially brought by COVID-19. For example, for our safety, we needed to stick to our strict safe distancing and zoning measures. But we supported one another and overcome every obstacles together. I am proud to be part of the DTSS project. We have created a strong safety culture, ensuring that every worker is protected and supported. Also ensure the timely and efficient completion of our projects. Amidst the challenges and setbacks, there were 20 triumphant TBM breakthroughs. The TBM breakthroughs marked significant milestones, with each one a testament to the team's relentless pursuit of progress. Recently, DTSS2 celebrated the last breakthrough, which marks the completion of all tunneling works. But our job is not done yet. The tunnels are exposed to a variety of corrosive elements, including used water, chemicals and gases. This can lead to degradation over time, weakening the structure integrity of the tunnels. By applying corrosion protection lining, it acts as a protective layer between the tunnels and the corrosive used water environment. Fiber optics cables are also embedded in the walls of the tunnel to monitor the structure integrity remotely. This removes the need for physical entry into the deep tunnels. Our team is our greatest asset. We face numerous challenges, but our shared vision and determination have always brought us through. 
This ambitious endeavor has brought to life by the tireless dedication, unwavering commitment, and remarkable teamwork of the countless individuals. The deep tunnel sewerage system is more than just a marvel of engineering. It's a story of human perseverance, unity, and the unwavering belief in creating a more sustainable and water-resilient Singapore for years to come.